Well, there was also a bill going through the legislative session that would address potential spying by other countries. The bill deals with foreign ownership of land. The state senator behind the bill, though, says the recent Chinese spy balloon over Montana illustrates the need for it. Here's MTN's David J. As of the end of 2021, China companies own more than 384,000 acres of agricultural land in the United States. I'm less than a half a mile away from uh, a missile site, and actually my brother owns the ground around the missile site. There's no way we'd ever sell to somebody like that. Eric Sommerfeld grows wheat and barley in power just north of Great Falls and is a Montana Farmers Union board member. He's a big supporter of Montana Senate Bill 203 introduced last week. Its goal? Prohibiting foreign adversaries from buying, leasing, or renting critical infrastructure in Montana, including land used for agriculture. Letting a foreign adversary have control over our food supply is very dangerous. The legislation was drafted after a land purchase in North Dakota when a Chinese food manufacturer bought 300 acres of land near Grand Forks Air Force Base. But the bill's backers say there have also been other examples. In 2013, a Chinese company purchased Smithfield Foods, the largest pork producer in the world. And in here in Montana, we have seen more land being purchased by foreign companies, up from 843,000 acres in 2020 to more than 916,000 acres in 2021. There is pause for concern for many of our members. Ray Lee Honeycutt is with the Montana Stock Growers Association, one of several agriculture groups that support the bill. She's worried about food security. If you care about the security of our country, if you care about food security, um, definitely it's something that everyone should be paying attention to. We have the U.S. Department of Commerce telling us there are adversarial nations and to be aware and that we need to do our part to protect our borders. And this is how we can do it. Miles City State Senator Ken Bogner is the main sponsor of the legislation. Federal law does not restrict the amount of private agricultural land that can be foreign owned, and no state has an absolute prohibition, but legislatures in Montana and Wyoming are each considering bills to change that. It's making sure the people here in Montana and the U.S. have the highest quality, the safest food, and at a reasonable price. As for this bill, it's legislation that was in the works long before the Chinese balloon was spotted, but one that may now have even more support because of it. In Billings, David J, MTN News.